Hello YouTube and Preppers, this is the Comms Prepper and we're digging out from the blizzard of 2016 we're right at the retreat location in West Virginia in today's video we're going to demonstrate some more features of ICOMS ID 51 Alpha Plus handheld radios in today's video we're going to show text messaging between radios in simplex mode that's radio to radio using the RS-MS1 Alpha application from the Google Play Store I have two tablets here, the tablet on the left I bought at Walmart for $39 and the tablet on the right I borrowed from one of the comms prepper helpers. We're going to connect the tablets to the radio with the OPC 2350LU data cable. I've got the speaker mic there. My friend up here on the mountain also has an amateur radio license so he's going to operate this radio. He also has a data cable that we're going to connect to that tablet. And over here we have ICOM's throat mic that he can choose to use if he'd like to free up his hands. So there's a nice suite of accessories available for the ID51 Alpha radio series. So we're going to set up both radios with the tablets to do text messaging between them. My buddy's going to stay here at the retreat location with this tablet and I'm going to hop on the ATV and take off on the mountain here and find a nice undisclosed location and see if we can't send text messages back and forth in simplex mode or radio to radio mode using ICOM's ID 51 Alpha Plus handheld radios in digital mode. So let's get this all packed up and get to our location. Alright guys, I got everything set up. I've been trying to reposition to deal with the glare coming off the equipment, but I just can't seem to beat it here. What you're looking at here is the Android tablet running the RS MS1 Alpha application. We're in text messaging mode. We're on a simplex channel. I got my buddy up at the retreat location. I've got a message already sitting in the transmit box and I'm going to go ahead and hit transmit. And we should get a response back from him as soon as he gets that. And the static you're hearing is I have... Yep, we just got a message in there. Copy. The static you're picking up is a contemporary FM analog handheld. I brought three down. So anybody who has a contemporary analog handheld and is on the same frequency, when you're running the DV mode on the radio, and you can see there it says DV-G. The G has to do with the... GPS status string coming out. When you're in DV mode, the only thing a contemporary analog amateur radio is going to hear is a static burst or a data burst. So I'll go ahead and send another message back to my buddy here. Doing this left-handed. Send. Send. Let's say send time. And I already spelt it wrong. But we should be able to do spell checking. There we go. And now we sent the message out, send time. And you'll hear another data burst on the analog radio, and that'll be his response. And oh, <laughs> he's getting time good. All right, so that's data mode. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch the handheld radio to analog mode. And you can see that the ID51 Alpha Plus handheld, even though it's a digital radio, also has compatibility with contemporary analog radios. So let me go ahead and set the mode button here to FM wide. That's FM narrow, digital mode, FM. So let me go ahead and give my buddy a call here. I'm going to switch hands with the, with the camera and give him a call. N3LJA, N3LJA from K1DOS, copy. And as you can see here, guys, the analog radio picked that up just fine. So now we're actually going to switch to digital mode. So I'm going to press the DV button here, or the mode button, and go back into digital mode. And we're in digital mode. And now I'll call out to my buddy up at the retreat location. N3LJA, N3LJA from K1DOS. There you have it. We had digital voice communications between the two ICOM radios. The contemporary analog radios just picked up static. So I'm going to turn the volume down just a little bit and we'll let you hear the digital voice quality. N3LJA from K1DOS. How copy the station? Uh, you're loud and clear. N3LJA. Roger that. Thank you. 
while I'm in digital mode, I can do voice communications, but now I'm going to send another text message. I'm going to say heading back. We'll hit transmit. And he should have picked that up on the tablet and give me a response. And he sent me a response, affirmative. So there you have it, guys. Digital communications in the field, sending text messages over a two meter amateur radio with the ICOM ID51 Alpha with an Android tablet running the RS-MS1 Alpha application. We did digital communications, we did voice communications, and we showed how this radio can interact if needed to with contemporary analog radios. And as always, thank you for watching my videos and subscribing to my channel. This has been the comms prepper with an introductory video on ICOM's text messaging feature in the application. Thanks for watching, guys. Just a short addendum, guys. It's not only YouTube video making here at the retreat location. Having some fun today running around in the ATV. Thanks for watching.